A Stayers Condition Race is next. Over two miles at the top of what Dunstan the Rhythm for Martin Lidham. Easter Sunday for Nick Driver. Gospel Sp Gospel Spell for Derek Hinton. Santa Brody, James Shea. Silk Kimono, Alex Cherry. Tapped Court, Leon Van Rensburg. Texas, Greg Beckwith. Zephonic Bell for Graham Clitterbuck. Zafua Mint, Jamie Hopkins. Bad Medicine, Paul Parsons. Fivey Jasmine for David Robertson. Ah, the bottom one was Jim Murray's Regina High Star. They're all installed, ready to go, and off they go. And it's going to be Gospel Spell. Who's going to be the first one to show, I think. From Silk Kimono. I'm sure that one was around last season. Dance to the Rhythm is in third. That one was around last season and actually managed to win a race. This is a conditioned race, not a maiden, so he's allowed to run in it. And Regina High Star on the outside is in fifth. Then comes Easter Sunday. Texas is after that one. I suppose technically people could have put more than one in this, but it being a conditioned race, not a maiden, but I don't think anybody thought of it. And it's Silk Komodo in the loop from Bad Medicine second. Dance to the Rhythm is third, and then Regina High Star is fourth. And that one comes Gosbeck Spell. And Easter Sunday and Tax Court. Not quite sure what the conditions are for these conditions races, because yesterday in the Winter Derby, I was, was under the impression that the top horse, Ozzy Anshan, that won, would be carrying a whopping great group one winning penalty, but he didn't. And he's he just won. So, I'm not quite sure what was going on there. Oh, whether there are supposed to be penalties or not. I'm just a little bit disgruntled at Miles for his fifth and got put up £36 on his last race of last season, which I thought was a little bit mean. But anyway, Silk Kimono's in the lead. Come on, Bad Medicine second. And Regina High Star is in third. And we've danced to the rhythm fourth. And Gospec spells after that one in fifth. Santa Brody after that and then Easter Sunday and Tax Court but Silk Kimono he's in the lead there with a mile to go Bad Medicine second Regina High Star third Dance to the Rhythm fourth and then Gospec Spurs after that one in fifth and Tax Court next and then Zephua Mint Easter Sunday in Texas and Santa Brody's after that and Farley Jasmine a phonic bell just a back marker and all. I think that was around last season as well I've got six furlongs still to go uh, Silk Kimono being joined there by Regina High Star in second Dance to the Rhythm is third Gosbeck Spell is fourth Tax Court on the outside of them fifth and the grey Bad Medicine with Zephua Mint on the outside next and Fivey Jasmine alongside that one on the inside rail Texas and that one may have been around as well last year. Santa Brody and Zephonic Bell after them, and then finally Easter Sunday at the back. Silk Kimono with three furlongs to go. He's still in the lead from Regina High Star in second. Really beginning to bunch up behind there. Texas, the one who's making some good ground, bursting through into third as Regina High Star takes it up. So Regina High Star then hits the front. Silk Kimono now dropping away in second and has been passed by Texas. Also Tax Court coming with one. Bad Medicine's running a big race. Fivey Jasmine is after that one. Then Gosbeck Spell is next. Zephonic Bell is trying to run on as well, but it's Regina High Star who's in the lead inside the final furlong. Tax Court is in second. Texas is run petered out pretty quickly in third. But it's Regina High Star now being pressed by Tax Court and Tax Court is beginning to get up to take it. Tax Court with you. Regina High Star second in Zephonic Bell. Finally Jasmine Texas. Bad Medicine after that one. And all the way back to Gospex Bell who was last I think in the end. And it's a win for Leon and Tax Court. Tax Court takes it then for Leon Van Rensburg. Regina High Star for Jim Murray was second. There's a phonic bell for Graham Clutterbuck was third. Fourth was Fivey Jasmine for David Robertson. Fifth was Texas for Craig Beckwith, rated 110. So if he's rated 110, tax courts will have to get about 120. <laughs> Bad medicine is next. Anyway, I'll pass you over to Jim now for the rest of today's races. <laughs> 